But like I said, if you want to more exclusive content and you want more, you know what I'm saying, exclusive conversations and Bible study every Monday night at 9 o'clock p.m., get your butt in that Facebook Messenger group. You can go into that Facebook Messenger group by simply sending me a friend request to my Facebook page, PSTR Michael Smith on Facebook. That's PSTR Michael Smith on Facebook. Go ahead, Brother Israel. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. This is our own content. I forgot about that. Bobby Valentino is back at his old games again. Oh, is he back at his old games again? Because to my recollection, I heard that Bobby Valentino got caught with another tranny. Is that true, Brother Israel? From the video i seen that they claim to be... Um Bobby Valentino with another training. Um, yeah, it looks like he's getting ready to do some um, some malicious things. Now you know a lot of people may may think that you know Bobby Valentino like track like like trannies and Bobby Valentino is doing this on purpose and you you know what I'm saying. You may think this is all of Bobby Valentino's just getting caught with a tranny. Now. The embarrassment, because that was an embarrassment the first time. Matter of fact, Brother Israel, read that news report on the first time he got caught with the tranny. 2017, I think it was. Yes, sir. 2017. This is from BET.com. Um, this was published in August 2000. I mean, two, yeah, 2017, August 24th. This is his first. Accusation of being with a, or being caught with a transgender. The article headline I'm about to read from is Bobby V and his transgender accuser will face off in court. Oh, so she took him to court. Yes, sir. Ooh. That's how, that's how it went. Um. You know, it was it, it, that was like pretty much everyone knew that. Yeah, I, I didn't know. I, I guess I didn't follow up on the report. I only did the report when <laughs> that happened. No, not a lot of people know about it because there's no. I looked it up. There's no um, articles on it or anything. Oh, really? Yeah, there's no. Not there's nothing in the air. Like it only comes back when I type in in a search bar code. Uh huh. The search bar. And um, I type in Bobby B and transgender. Literally, uh, the only thing that pops up is the 2017 case. That's it. So this court case didn't pop up. This court. Case I mean, I mean, this this court case you you don't see it widely spread like 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 the incident. Like the incident, um, the recent incident, like um, whenever it happened of the, the video I watched. Not the video that you watched. The uh, other one. 2017. No, 2017. There's articles of that one. There's there's a whole bunch of articles from different websites and stuff like okay, that. Okay, but but him going, but him but the, the training. That's recent. Yeah. There's nothing of it. I just seen the video. That's it. Oh, okay, okay. So no, because what I was saying was, you know, what I'm saying I did not know that the tranny had took him to court. Yeah, no, I guess that's that's what this article pretty much reads. This is not the same tranny, is it? What, the one I need to get with? Yeah. No, it's not the same one, I don't think. Okay, let's, let's hear about this tranny take him to court, because I didn't hear about this. All right. Bobby Valentino's public drama is far from over. Bobby and Rayma Houston, the transgender woman who accused the singer of attempting to coast course her into having sex with him are reportedly gearing up to face off in the courtroom. 
and something tells us it's going to get a lot messier before it gets any better. As previously reported, Bobby's legal team filed a suit against Houston, claiming she was guilty of extortion. The Mrs. Officer singer alleges Houston took an unauthorized video of him during their late night encounter. And when he asked about it, she threatened to release it on social media unless he paid her several several thousand dollars. Houston previously spoke to BET exclusively in which she divulged her side of the story. She detailed her first meeting with Bobby in which she offered to kickstart her career by featuring her in a new music video. But upon a later meeting in her apartment, Bobby tried to engage in sexual activity to which Houston declined. The clip that was previously circulating the internet was reportedly taken in response to him unbuttoning his pants seconds before. So wait a minute. So you mean to tell me Bobby Valentino was trying to put a tranny in his next music video? Um, in 2017, around 2017, yeah. <laughs> Ain't that some shit? And if that music video would have came out, you would have had a whole bunch of thirsty niggas drooling over that tranny right. in his video, thinking that tranny is, is a female. Is a female. Do you see, do you get my point? Do you see my point here? So that means you niggas better question every damn woman that you see in these music videos, even uh -huh. even Megan the Stallion. <laughs> So go so okay so that's the first incident. Now this the second incident. I don't know if they won that case. I don't know if that tranny won that case or if it got thrown out or if Bobby Valentino came to a conclusion because that's back in 2017. I didn't do that report. But the video that you seen, brother Israel, of this incident now, what what trans what what did you see? I'm going to tell you what I've seen from the beginning to the end of the video. What I'm seeing is, um, you could, well, you could tell it's someone video recording from outside of the actual building. But it looks like, a, you know, like a big motel. It looks like, a, you could clearly see, you know, the man slash woman, the man, walking, right, um, towards uh, Bobby V. Bobby V comes out of like an elevator or a door or something like that into the lobby of the motel. He walks up to the man slash woman, man, and uh, kisses her. Then they walk back towards where Bobby B came from, you know, heading towards inside of uh, his uh, personal uh, room. And um, you can only guess what happens from there. Bobby, and, and, and let me tell you something, people. This is just one guy. Every male that passes his soul to the fire of Moloch do the same thing. You know what I'm saying? Your young thugs. Even the baby. I know the baby, you know what I'm saying? Seems like a, you know what I'm saying? A gangster rapper and shit. He does the same shit. Little baby do the same shit. Little Bootsy. Do the same shit. All of these rappers do this because it's all about satanic sex magic with the same sex is what makes them pop. You know what I'm saying? Bobby Valentino, you know what I'm saying, need to get his career started back. This is a this is an old satanic sex ritual. And to all of you so-called nigga Africans, you know what I'm saying, who think niggas who think you're African. This is what an African ritual. This is this is this is, is is satanic sex magic. You know what I'm saying? So it's it's not that he don't want. It's not that he he got a, a an addiction with trannies. Is that he need to do this in order to maintain his status? It's crazy. I mean, damn. 
But this is just breaking news, you know what I'm saying? And it's just breaking. So uh, when I get more details on a situation, when, when me and Brother Israel get more details, well, I'm going to say Brother Israel because he the one that do the research. When Brother Israel get more details on a situation, we'll do an update um, video on this, an update uh, on this. And so, you know what I'm saying? Whether you're on the podcast, make sure you hit that follow button. If you're on YouTube, make sure you hit that subscribe button because we are going to bring you an update on this situation. This just happened. So, you know what I'm saying? We just catching the news now. Um, you want to stay updated, make sure you, um, get your butt into that Facebook Messenger group. We got more exclusive content, you know what I'm saying, exclusive conversations. We got the weekly Bible study class where you can understand the scriptures line upon line in that Bible study class. Tonight's Bible study class is going to be on faith. And you need to get into that Bible study class. Well, all you have to do is send me a friend request to my Facebook page. That's PSTR, Michael Smith on Facebook. And I'll add you to the group. And that Bible study class is tonight at 9 o'clock p.m. Every week, every Monday at 9 o'clock p.m. Um, I'm your host. I'm your pastor, Mr. Michael Smith. My co-host is Brother Lamik Israel. If you're new to this channel, please tap that subscribe button. Hit that like button, share button, and comment board. Till next time, stay tuned. God bless you.